guys? It's AZ with Mad Dog Life. I'm real excited right now, real late right now. Um, I'm supposed to drop my car off about 4.35 o'clock right now. It is 5.31. But I'm dropping my car off with Drew to get my ceramic coating on it. I got cars in front of me. I just called him to make sure he was still there. He was like, yo, I'm here all evening. Your car is getting coated tonight. So that hopefully I can pick it up by 6 o'clock tomorrow night. It's going to stay in his bay. Out of the elements, um, out of the dust, out of everything. Let the coat dry. Let everything kind of cure up there correctly. And um, hopefully I can take it tonight. They'll cars and coffee on Sunday morning. Burn that the weather, uh, the weather agrees with me. But like I said, real excited. It costs a grip of money, but I think it's worth it if you're a car guy, if your car, you know, if you get your uh, your paint correct and all that stuff and everything looks good on your car, go ahead and get it. Go ahead and get it coated. That's going to make car washing a little bit easier and it's going to just um, help with the wear and tear of your paint job and stuff. So, like I said, we'll see what it looks like afterwards. Y'all stay tuned. Right, the pull up is happening. The pull up is happening. You see, I don't really know where I'm going. Obviously, because I turned down the wrong street. That's okay. We're gonna whip it around right now. Second gear just pops, crackles, it sounds like I'm driving a firecracker. Y'all catch my true emotions right now, my excitement. <laughs> over there making it happen right now. All right guys, we're gonna find out what Drew could do with his craft. All right, what's up guys? It's AC back at you with uh, Mad Dog Life. Here we go, I got Drew back here. Um, Going ahead and starting the process of doing my ceramic coat on the bullet. Going on right now. Just doing a quick milk over, quick print, quick wash. Um, we took a look at it with the super bright lights up here to uh, see if it needed any paint correction. But he says he's going to go over it up uh, real lightly anyway. But, of course, I try not to get in the soil box or anything in it anyway. And this is uh, kind of stage one of the process. And he's going through this again. Stay tuned. Alright, we're going to this stage now. We've wrapped off the, the loose dirt. And it's going around. Get the foam tin in. Looking real good. Let him do his work. All right, guys, I'm still in the bay with Andrew. He's going around the car, spraying some kind of contaminant on the car that will pull an iron and stuff out of it, which he likes to call bleed. Your car is going to bleed. And what it looks like when it bleeds is right here where it's kind of pulling some iron. I don't know if you can see that right up in there where it's turning purple. And that is 
what's that, Drew? You say iron in the paint iron or just iron on just, just contaminants that's on top of my paint, pretty much. It's uh, kind of pulling it to the surface and pulling it off. He sprayed it on my wheels as well. And, um, pump motors in here getting done up. Uh, leaving a little bit up here up top. Again, right here on the corner of this front. Contaminant heavy. Really bad down here over the lights as well. But let's get this done. About the rinse now. Right. We're still in the booth. He's uh, he's rinsed it, he's washed it, um, foamed it, he bled it. I think it looks damn good right now. But Drew said, oh wait, it gets better. Um, Drew's not a man to jump on the camera. So um, if you're in the Raleigh area, look him up on YouTube. Drew's um, automotive coatings and he'll hook you up. He's coated my wheels, he's coated my paint, my panels down here. But, whoo! And it's rinsed away now, but when he said it will drip purple, Pulling the contaminants and iron and stuff out. All of this around the car was pretty much purple kind of drainage that came off of the car. Uh, you might be able to see some of it right there. But that light, that light hitting off that green is crazy. Right there, the light looks good. What's up, everybody? It's AC with Mad Dog Life. Um, I grabbed my buddy John, my forerunner, and we made it back out here to Johnson Johnson uh, Auto Body, where Drew has finished putting a ceramic coating on the Mustang Bullet. Um, he started yesterday, probably about five, probably about five thirty. He's done today at twelve. So it's the next day, uh, about twelve thirty. Pulling it out now. Thing looks like it's wet. Good gracious. It's pretty good. He's done my wheels as well. So nice and shiny. Anybody's wondering, that's the product that was used. G Technique, is that like that? But anybody in Raleigh looking to get their car ceramic coated, look up Andrew. Andrew, was it Andrew's? Uh, Drew's Automotive Coated. Um, I'm gonna do a quick walk around the car. Check it out. It feels slippery. I know this camera's probably not putting it in perspective, but my my wheels actually they look like different wheels. Just because they're I guess shiny or coated. But looking good guys. All right, I'll catch y'all later. And there's John. Woo! Look at that thing. Y'all see it. Respect it. Y'all better put some respect on my Mustang, boy. That thing look good rolling, boy. He's killing it. Woo! Get some.